Hey all mathematics lover, it's a quick math flash time. Let's multiply 17 by 13. I have a very simple and unique way to multiply 17 by 13. You have to consider the second digit of first number and multiply it with the second digit of last number. That means multiply 7 times 3 which is equals to 21. Write this 1 exactly here and 2 as a carry on your hand. Then add this 17 with this 3. That means 17 plus 3 is 20 plus 2 is 22. 221 is the answer of 17 times 13. Is not it simple? This is method number 1 and I can multiply the same thing by different method. 17 times 13. So I can rewrite this 17 as a 15 plus 2. That means 15 plus 2 is 17. Multiplication sign. 13 is 15 minus 2. We know a very famous formula from our childhood. x square minus y square which equals to x plus y times x minus y. That means you can consider x as a 15 and y as a 2. 15 square minus 2 square. 15 square means 225 minus 2 square is 4. So 225 minus 4 is 221. This is the result. I can I multiply 17 times 13 two different way. Is not it interesting? Well, don't go. I'm gonna to show you another uh, mathematical tricks. You can multiply any number by 11 within 5 seconds. Let us consider 95 times 11. What you have to do is write this 9 on one hand side and 5 on another hand side by keeping a certain distance. And then just simply add this two number 9 plus 5 which is 14. 14 write 4 here and carry 1 that should be added with 9. That is 9 plus 1 is 10. This 4 is here and 5 is here. So 1045 is the answer of 95 times 11. Okay let's try another um, numbers. 21 times 11. Same way write this 2 1 one hand side and one this one another hand side and simply add these two numbers 2 plus 1 is 3 that means 231 is the answer is not it simple <laughs> okay math is really fun if you know the tricks mathematics is not uh, so much complex let me show you something different and uh, interesting things well um, do you know how you can easily calculate uh, the square of any number let's say 16 square right so what you have to do is write this one here and multiply this 6 with 2 that means 6 by 2 multiplication is 12 and next step is you have to multiply this 6 with itself that means 6 times 6 which is 36 so we have one, two, three, four, five digit. This is pretty much long. That is not the correct answer. So correct answer is you have to add these two numbers and you have to add these two numbers as well. That means one plus one is two, two plus three is five and rest of them is six. That means 256 is the answer of 16 square. <laughs> it's not it simple. Let's try another number. Let's say, um, 18 square same rules applied here what you have to do is write this one exactly here and uh, multiply this 8 with 2 8 times 2 is 16 and then multiply this 8 with itself that means 8 means 8 sorry 8 times 8 is 64 so this is pretty much long number that is not the correct answer so what we have to do we have to add this one and that one 1 plus 1 is 2, 6 plus 6 is 12 and remaining is 4. 
we have to process this we have to work out again until it's reduced to three digits still now it has one two three four digit so we have to add again this first two value two plus one is three this two remaining here four remaining here now it is the answer 324 is the answer let's say um, uh, 13 square right it's very easy sometimes you can remember it 13 square means write this one here and multiply this three times two is six and multiply three with itself that means three times three is nine that means 169 is the answer it's not it's simple <laughs> so if you know the tricks mathematics is not so much complex it's very easy i'm gonna to show you something interesting thing let us consider there is a sequential square 15 is square, 25 is square, 35 is square, 55 is square, and so on, up to 105 is square, or even the longer number. So is it possible to remember or memorize all those square value in your head? It's quite impossible, right? But if you know the tricks, you can apply your tricks on this um, problem and you can solve it very easily. I have very simple, unique tricks. Let us consider any number. Let's say 35 is square. How to calculate this 35 is square uh, without any memorization? So consider this 35 square, 35 square. Now what you have to do, only you have to consider the exactly immediate next number of this three. Next number of three is four. And then multiply this two number. Three times four is, three times four is 12. And then you have to write this square as a two here and this five exactly here. That means 1225 is the answer. If I, um, um, if I use the calculator, then you can see 35 square means 35 times 35, which is 1225, exactly same value. Well, let us um, consider again another number, this 85 square. How to calculate? 85 square exactly the same way what I have to do I have to imagine exactly immediate next number of 8 which is 9 then I have to multiply this 9 by 8 that means 9 times 8 is 72 right and then you have to write this 2 but that is square as a 2 and then 5 exactly here. That means 7225 is the answer. 105 square. 105 square. What we have to do, let us consider this 10, one, uh, one number. And we have to imagine the immediate next number, which is 11. Then multiply 11 by 10. 11 times 10 is 110. And very simple, write this square as a 2 here and write this 5 exactly here. That means 11,025 is the answer. If you enjoy my videos, I would um, request you to subscribe my channel. It will help me a lot to make further better content and it will inspire me. Please share and subscribe my channel and thank you for watching.